Diamond Bee Farm coming at you. We are currently on our way to the, um, just to check out the Mennonite sale. That will be tomorrow, April 3rd. Um, we will be putting some of our poultry into the sale and also just experiencing the sights. We um, come to this sale every year and we, we, and we just absolutely love it. They have lots of plants. They have, I'm so excited about. They will have lots of meat and cheese and lots of good food. Um, I, we just can't wait. We're going to go back home and get our cages ready and get some things done after we check this out. Um, we look forward to sharing it with you. Yeah, so um, there is a ton of farm equipment which Dad is completely obsessed over. He stays up there all day and just listens to the auctioneers um, do their little talk and yeah hopefully we can bring home some goodies tomorrow so we are going to show you kind of sort of what's there on, on the day before and then the day of and yeah we are going to go home after this and get our chickens ready and get their cages all prepped so we will see you then Right in here, and then I'll be ready mm -hmm. to go. They're selling rocks. My mom used to have one of these. It's a geode, right? She did. She used to have one of them. Yeah, we do, don't we?
That is so pretty. <laughs> so very pretty. Oh cool, they are states. That's awesome. I love that one though. Farmer's market idea. Look at that big swing. Oh yeah, that is a huge swing, isn't it? Yeah, that'd be awesome. To take some of our vegetables in. Oh, yeah. I guess. He said that this fell on power and all. So cool. Very patriotic. We have some very exciting news. So we are going to be putting in some of our chicken stocks um, that we've raised this year to one of the little Amish auctions. It's so exciting. Um, and right now I'm going to be filming that process and showing you all what we do to get ready for this sale. So, um, we are very excited. This is our very first one. And yeah, it's going to be an adventure. So excited. So, time change um, from our last video. It's dark. We just finished catching all of our um, adult chickens. And now then we are working on getting their, um, their cell cages ready for tomorrow. So we can put them easier tomorrow morning. Um, and I will show you what those look like. So the ones with the metal roofs, that's going to hold our adult pears that we're going to sell. And then the smaller ones are for our chicks. Dad also has um, one more set up for his quail that he is going to sell. So we are going to put some straw in there with them. Just so, you know, they have something to like stand on for footing and so it doesn't get the cage that messy and it'll it'll look very nice so mom you want to do the honors i'm doing it <laughs> it also keeps them warm yeah it's gonna be cold tomorrow i have a great job <laughs> Too much in 
one. Yeah, it looks like a. That's it. Look at that. I'm going to get them over and lay us. They'll trample it down. Aren't these cages nice? So, Dad, do you want to tell them what the dimensions are? Uh, they're 18 by 18 on the big ones. 18 by 18 on the big ones. And the small ones are 10 by 18. And the small ones are 10 by 18. And then they're just wrapped around with chicken wire. Um, yeah, so he has drilled holes in the top that we are going to zip tie down whenever we get the chickens ready in the morning. I think I'm making more of a mess of this. I'm not getting your face. He doesn't want to be on camera, but he wants us to do this YouTube channel. Um, so. Which we're excited about. We are. We are excited about it. <laughs> So right now, all he's doing is getting our um, cages ready for labeling whenever we get the chicks in there. So that's what Dad's going to be using for his quail. Um, and yeah, looking pretty good, isn't it? And hey, if you don't mind, go like, share, um, subscribe. subscribe to our channel. Um, and be sure to look for more stuff because we have got a lot going on. That is very, very true. So, if you can't hear them in the background, that's our quail going absolutely nutso. Here they are. This is the row that Dad's going to be selling tomorrow. Those are our layers. Aren't they cool? Party in the coop. So, I guess this will be like a little update video on them too. So, aren't they looking cool? Let me to thread them through. If you're going to thread them through, you can zip tie them. Okay. Looking good. Looking good. Your hands are going to be internet famous, Daddy. Because no one's going to know what your face looks like. He's going to be, um, he's quite handsome, you guys. Are you going to do this side, too? Not the long side, I'll do No, this is a short we got seven chicks, five weeks old, both Orpington. Seven chicks, five weeks old, both Orpingtons. All righty, by the piece, follow the bill on a five, five in the final seven, ten bin a seven, little bill on a seven, we're in a seven. Seven bin a seven, little bill on a seven, bin a seven, a ten. Ten bin a ten, little bill on a ten. Ten bin a, about eight. I got seven about eight. Eight little bill on a eight. Eight bin a eight, little bill on a eight bin. I got two at seven, eight. Eight bin a eight, little bill on a eight bin, a eight where? Eight bin a eight, little bill on a eight bin, a eight. Give me eight dollar bill on a eight. Sold at seven dollars to number eight nine nine, eight ninety nine. This is just a little recap video of what all happened this weekend. It was so crazy. I mean, it was action-packed. There was oh, so much going on and there were so many people. So we really didn't get that many videos. But um, just to kind of tell you about how our chickens did and how everything else went. Um, our chickens sold very well. We are very, very pleased with um, what all they brought and hopefully our next generation chickens will also go there and do very well. Um, and Dad's quail did really great too. So we sold almost 40 chickens. Can you believe that? that 40 lot. chickens. We had 40 chickens, oh, that's crazy. But that was, that was almost half of our entire flock. Um, and to think we still have some that are about to come off of the incubator. 
So, um, you know, chickens just never stop. Um, yeah, so we are very, very happy. We actually really didn't buy anything. I bought a quilt and mom bought some plants. So, um, yeah. Be looking for the strawberry palette project. Yeah, that's, that's going to be fun. And as you can see from the plowed garden behind us, we've been rather busy this weekend. So that's that's another reason why we didn't get a lot of videos. But we do hope you enjoy what you do, what you are going to see, and like, subscribe, hit that notification button. Yeah. <laughs> um, you know, tell your friends. And hey, if you want to see a project done, or leave it in the comments, and we'll be gl more than happy to research it and follow through with it. Yeah, so um, do all she said and check back with us for more videos. So until then, bye! See ya!